Good morning everyone, welcome to At Home With Redeemer, this week with the... Bakemans. Hello, good morning. We hope you're having a good morning. Well, first up, we're going to do thumbs up. And thumbs down. Okay, so let me have a think. My thumbs up for the week uh, has been I've got to do loads of drawing, which I really like to do. My thumbs down is uh, I wanted it to be 25 degrees and sunny every day, but we only had like one or two days in that temperature. Uh, how about you, Elisa? So, okay. so I, um, my thumbs up was that I would be, I, I had, I, I would be able to, um, mm. I like made up a story, so like, I'm like, I'm going to be an awful when I'm in, uh, well, I'm actually going to be an awful when I'm a child as well, but I've actually started a story on the computer, and I have another story, and another story that I need to start, and there's a whole series of them, and the bad, and then, the, and then my bad thumbs up is that I, is that I can't wait to write them on the computer, and it takes ages for me to write them, so I ask my mum to write them, and then I can't write them, so that's my thumbs down. Yeah, fan fantastic, Elisa. Well, um, let's see. Uh, what, Jesse, what do you think? What was your thumbs up this week? Mm. Oh, well, that was a bit rude, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah. Jesse, that was a little bit rude. And uh, <laughs> so, what was Xavier's thumbs up and thumbs down? Do you want to tell us? No. Nah. No, he doesn't. Okay. Well, Maybe his thumbs up and thumbs down is that he, his thumbs up, that he plays playable all day, and his thumbs down is that he doesn't want to do the video. Okay, well, now we're going to go on to uh, something else. I think about writing a journal of all the things that you're thankful for uh, and all the things that you like doing in the week. It's always good to be thinking about the things that we're grateful for. Um, this week's topic is all about miracles. And we're going to have our reading of the Bible, which is going to be done by Elisa. Over to you, Elisa. Thank you, Daddy. Jesus' early miracles mark. One, Jesus travelled through Capernaum with his disciples, Simon, Andrew, James and John. He went to the synagogue on the Sabbath and went to teach. The people there were surprised. Jesus' teaching was not like the scribe's teaching. He spoke of authority. Just then, a man of unclean spirit shouted, What do you have to do with us, Jesus of Nazareth? Have you come to stay and destroy us? I know who you are. You're the Holy One of God. Jesus commanded the spirit to be quiet and come out of the man. The spirit yelled again and came out. Everyone was amazed. Who is, this Jesus, who is this Jesus, they asked. He, te he teaches authority, the unclean spirits obey him. News that Jesus spread quickly throughout Galilee. Next, Jesus and his disciples went to Simon and Andrew's house. Simon's mother-in-law was in bed with fever. Jesus went to look at her, went to her and took her hand. He healed her. She got up and began to serve them. That evening, large crowds of people came over to the house of others who were sick or bothered by evil spirits. Jesus healed them. Early the next morning, Jesus went out by himself to pray. Simon and the other disciples found him and said, Everyone is looking for you, Jesus said. Come on, let's go to the nearby villages so I can pray to you there. This is why I have come. Jesus travelled throughout Galilee. He preached and drove out the demons. A man with skin disease came to Jesus. He got on his knees and begged, If you are willing, you can make me clean. Jesus was willing. He healed the man. Now to you, Mummy. Hello, everybody. We're going to play another version of Simon Says. It is Jesus Says. So. Jesus says, touch your head. Jesus says, touch your nose. Touch your shoulders. Jesus says, turn around. Jesus says, touch the ground. T put your hands on your hips. That was great. Was everyone able to do it? 
Now, over to this week's challenge. It's called the Helpomatic, okay? Your uh, task is to draw a picture of a machine that can help people do something they have trouble with or really don't like doing. So have a really good think about it. What do they do? How do their machines work? And how much might they cost? So that's the challenge for you to have a go and to show your parents or carers this week, okay? And also, there's a... This week's writing challenge. A writing challenge for you guys. Um, I want you to think and write about miracles you would like to see happen this year. Year. This year, not next year. This year. And now it's time for the M prayer. Thank you God for the leadership and that we have this amazing fellowship. Thank you God for the NHS. All those people are the best. Thank you for Redeemer Church. We pray that others can continue to search. Thank you that we have been able to meet together again. This is the end of the prayer. Amen. Amen. Bye.